The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Ted DiBiase, representing Money Incorporated. From the District of Columbia, weighing in at 248 pounds, I-R-S. Such a tremendous athlete. Bad attitude, though. Yeah, it's a real shame that they don't respect anyone. Not their fellow superstars, not even the WWE Universe. Respect has to be earned, Saxton. More superstars could stand to remember that. Facing his most consequential hour, Megan engulfed in the flames. Here we go, guys. And his opponent from the pits of hell. Weighing in at 323 pounds, the Superstar. There may be no more terrifying figure in all of WWE than this man right here. Man, that's being generous, Michael. I'd say Kane's more of a monster. A competitor with his share of detractors, but he wants to prove them all wrong here tonight. And you are looking at one of the most unshakable superstars on the roster. Absolutely a picture of resilience. He's been through ups and downs, but has never given up the fight. Bitter perseverance is what will make him such a threat in this matchup. And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This is a great one. You got to think of a quick count. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. That's a counter with style. Toss across, right into a drop, the elbow to the arm. Knee left. Elbow finds its mark. Trap the arm. Let's cut to the chase, Corey. Kane is an absolute monster, but in the WWE, we've seen how easily David can beat Goliath. Are we looking at a biblical situation here tonight? We've seen underdogs come and go, but few of them face the devil's favorite demon. When Kane digs deep into that dark pit he calls a heart, he harnesses a supernatural power that can obliterate any opponent. Oh, striking with the knee drop. So he can end it. Perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat.